The need for amplifying the voices of our community is more important than ever. And video is one of the most powerful tools for engaging and connecting people. It's a medium that can show impact, tell stories, and educate. And for over 20 years, the Mount Hood Cable Regulatory Commission, or MHCRC, has provided funds to nonprofits, educators, libraries, and local governments to help these organizations produce video content that supports the public benefit. Since 1999, through the Community Technology Grants Program, the MHCRC has given out 207 grants, totaling more than $20 million in grant funding. These grants are meant to have a positive impact on the community, and so grant projects must fulfill a public benefit in one of these four areas. Reducing disparities, breaking down barriers for underrepresented groups, improving community involvement to strengthen local life, Cost reduction, for example, modernizing, streamlining, or improving efficiency of workflows. Improving service delivery, increasing the effectiveness of services to the public. The Commission uses equity-focused metrics throughout the review process. As an ally to those who've lived their lives in an environment of systemic oppression and racism, we want to make sure grant dollars are supporting programs that ensure our most vulnerable residents are not left behind. So who should apply? There are specific eligibility requirements and projects must follow certain guidelines to be considered for funding. A few of these requirements include, applicants must serve residents within Multnomah County, Oregon. These projects must produce video content to share on community media center channels. Grant funds can only be used for capital costs, such as equipment and training costs. There are additional requirements, so please see the website for a complete list of eligibility criteria. But money doesn't just grow on trees, so where do these grant funds come from? Well, the MHCRC regulates cable communications franchising and receives dedicated funds from local cable companies. Through the Community Technology Grants Program, it distributes these funds for video projects to community organizations. So how big are these grants anyway? In the past, grant sizes have ranged from $2,000 to $350,000. The average award size is around $100,000. Grants are scaled up or down depending on project goals. So whether your project is big or small, if you qualify, you should apply. In the last 20 years, the Community Technology Grants Program has supported a diverse selection of community organizations. Curious Comedy has used this grant to help promote women in comedy, and these marginalized voices share a perspective and insights and talents and styles that are so different and so exciting. Women in comedy say the hardest thing for them is to get a great video, which they need to further their careers. This grant's allowed us to provide these women with professional quality videos. The Big Up Show is a video series made for kids, by kids, and we really feel that we're empowering youth by giving them access to state-of-the-art video and audio technology that they're learning to a certain level of proficiency and sharing that content out through the world. It's a really joyful experience I find when they see themselves and it's work that they've done with their own hands. Our families face many barriers, uh, especially our, our multilingual families and our immigrant families. It's critical to learn to navigate technology in order for them to better support their children. And with this grant, we complemented the workshops with video tutorials. We knew that we could have a greater impact across David Douglas and not just support one community, but support multiple communities. Because, you know, there are a lot of those language barrier, cultural barriers, a lot of times our voice is missing in those places that could make a big difference. With these videos, when we highlight these stories, I feel like it encourages all of the community members to be able to just kind of like make a change, make a difference. So you're interested in applying, what's next? Our goal is to make this a highly collaborative process, so please get in touch. MHCRC staff are available to consult on project ideas and help with the application process. Don't hesitate to reach out and contact us.